An ode to the Sheriff of Shred. Oh, Sheriff of Shred, we see you making moves. Getting hitched, we all approve. Oh, Ryan Lynch, thank you for all the memories. Your friendship lasts for centuries. Oh, Mr. Lynch, Erica Green is the best fit. But Erica Lynch, we all permit. Oh, soon to be Mr. and Mrs. Lynch, we love you and are thinking about your special day. So here is a message we wanted to convey. Hey, bud. I'm so excited uh, for you this weekend. I just want to say that we love you so much, our whole family. We just think of the world of you, Kristen, uh, Gracie, myself. Um, couldn't be more happy for you. I just always think to myself, WWBD, what would Bud do? Um, because there's so many times in my life that I think, you know what, I should just act like Ryan in this scenario and be quick to forgive and be gracious because, um, man, you're just uh, such a loyal friend and gracious and I love that about you and uh, I know that whatever scenario we're in whatever group I bring you into that uh, they're gonna quickly like you more than they like me <laughs> and that you're gonna smooth things out and everybody just enjoys being around you and um, it's your personality is infectious but we're gonna be praying for you and Erica and your marriage and just praying that uh, God would protect things and that you'd be happy for years and years to come and just have a marriage that flourishes. So love you so much, bud. Can't wait to celebrate with you this weekend. Bye. Hey, Lynch. Celebrating you today, bud. Just... A message of encouragement and excitement uh, for you and Erica on your wedding day. Uh, Swain Train loves, appreciates, respects you. Uh, we're so grateful for the impact that you've made in our kids' lives over the years and that we've been friends as long as we have and we look forward to the journey ahead uh, with Mr. and Mrs. Uh, we pray blessings on you today, my friend. God bless. Grace upon grace. Hey there, Lynch. It's Taffel. Um, wanted to take a moment to talk about how much uh, your friendship has meant to me and to give some words of encouragement as you begin a new family here with Erica. Um, you know, over the last uh, seven years since moved to Fort Collins um, and I've started my own family, um, I am so grateful uh, and blessed in my life to have had the opportunity to become friends with you. Um, you know, the summers working together, um, and then just the friendships developed out of that. Um, I recall kind of meeting you first at, uh, coffee in the mornings, uh, when Swain did the men's group. Um, and just like immediately kind of like, I like this guy. And then um, going to a men's retreat and really kind of getting introduced uh, to you more. And it was one of those beginnings where we had mutual friends that I think knew right away that like you, these two would have a really good bromance. And that's what I think we've developed over the last... Um, six years and I you know I know that uh, Danny cherishes her relationship with you as well and I know how big you have been as a rock in being a support for me and our family and our marriage and our kids um, and I can't tell you how much that means to me I'm so looking forward uh, to being a part of your new family and I'm excited um, and proud of you 
uh, with um, the new challenges and adventures uh, that a marriage and, and with Erica will bring. And I just want you to know that um, Danny and I uh, will always be there to support um, your marriage and um, can't wait to have new adventures with you too and to be there um, to support the two of you through thick and thin, good times and bad. And um, I can't wait to, you know, to celebrate the good times Uh, be there when there's some of the low times and know that that's going to be a part of this future. And um, we just want you to know that we love you and we love uh, you and Erica and we're so happy for the two of you and um, can't wait to celebrate uh, this weekend and then this summer and uh, just want to know that uh, Lynch, I'm proud of you. I love you. Don't watch this too soon before your wedding because I'm sure you're going to be crying (laughs) watching all of these. Uh, Anyway, um, just wanted to say uh, we're there for you, buddy. And um, so happy for you. Love you, bro. Ryan Lynch. Happy wedding day, buddy. Chris O'Grady here. Hey, Uh, I just got to tell you, man, I love you. I'm so grateful for you. I'm so happy for you on this day. Um, Man, when I think about you, I think about Psalm number one, uh, oak of righteousness planted by calm streams. Um, Man, you know who you are. You stay firm with who you are. One of the things I love the most about you is, uh, man, you're not playing on anybody else's playbook. Uh, You play from from your own playbook, man. You you are grounded and rooted. Uh, You're rooted in his truth. Um, you're rooted in his majesty. Uh, and I'm, I'm so grateful for you. I'm so humbled that you're my friend. Uh, man, I hope this day is the coolest day ever. I know this isn't how y'all drew it up, um, but I know the day is going to be beautiful. Uh, I love you. I'm thinking about you today. Wish I could be there with you. Um, and I know this is going to be a special day for you and Erica. I love you, buddy. I love you and Erica. Um, and I can't wait to say, celebrate with y'all real soon. Hey, O'Grady, we're talking about... Jesus. Pizza and Jesus. Pizza and Jesus. Jesus. Bud. Just in the basement right now. I wish it was the basement that you and I, you know, used to share and hold hands and kiss in. But man, just love you. You're getting married. Dude, so exciting. I'm grateful for you. You're one of the best friends in the entire world. Um, Erica, that's one lucky woman. The things I would do to you. JK, JK. But, anywho, hey, I'm, I'm so glad that, um, yeah, I got to, to do so much life with you, and I'm grateful that, um, I'm grateful that you're not, like, moving away or dying, and I still get to continue to do life with you, but um, you're one of my best friends in the whole wide world, and, man, I'm so grateful for you. Um Sorry, we Mac and I could not be there with you on your day, but man, so so proud of you, so grateful for you. Um, yeah, love you, buddy. Hey, have fun being married. Hey, bud, you big son of a bud, how you doing? You're getting married. We, Karen and I, say hey. Woo! We're on our way to your wedding right now. Still for calls. We are on our way. <laughs> We are starting the mass journey to Lincoln, Nebraska. Uh, but anyway, I wanted to tell you that I love you. This is probably one of the best decisions you've ever made. Erica's amazing. She is a voice that gives you a voice. And that's what I love most about her. You are a strong friend. I love and adore you. And you've always been there for me. So I'm really stoked that I get to spend this day with you. This is longer than the 30 seconds Chief's gave me. But, this was Chief's idea. Give him props. Uh, Love you, man. Excited for you. See you tomorrow. Well, the time has come for you to get married. Obviously, we're very far away, and we would all love to be there, man, but 
Um, obviously with this year going the way it is, we can't, but we're supposed to make you a video to talk about why we love you and your strengths. And I want to combine those into a story. Um, we have a lot of different memories together. We have a lot of different stuff we've been through and stuff we're going through, but we met outside of Jim's Wings one day and we had a good conversation and we talked about stuff that was serious, stuff that was affecting us um, and stuff that we've both been through. Um, and I feel like in that moment, I saw you at a whole different depth and it opened my heart even more to you. Um, but I love you, man. Congratulations. So bummed we can't be there, but we'll obviously be on the Zoom. But um, good luck to you, big guy. Can't wait. Love you, man. To the Sheriff of Shred. So excited for you guys. Hope uh, you're doing well. Hope uh, those little butterflies in your stomach are churning as they should be. Um, wish we could be there with you and Erica. So excited for your beautiful day. Um, our thoughts and prayers are with you that uh, the whole day is just seamless and um, everything that you guys have, have worked for and, and hoped for and wanted. Um, on a personal note, I just want to thank you for uh, all that you've done for, for Haley and I and um, just being a part of our, our lives and our journey together. Um, thank you for your friendship. Thank you for your wisdom. Thank you for being a brother um, that I've never had. And, uh, you know, I love you from the bottom of my heart and I'm just... Uh, so excited for you guys and so grateful for for you and Erica and um, just really looking forward to your lives together. Um, I can't wait to celebrate with you guys in June and um, hopefully drink some beers with you soon so uh, we can relive some of those glory days of, uh, of Steamboat and all the fun experiences that we've had. Um, again, we're just praying for you, praying for uh, a beautiful day, beautiful transition into uh, the world of marriage for you guys and uh, Hopefully some rest and relaxation in Mexico as well. I want to leave you with a, uh, with a poem from my boy, Matthew McConaughey. It's called The Monster. The future is the monster, not the boogeyman under the bed. The past is something we're trying to outrun tomorrow. The monster is the future, the unknown. The boundaries not yet crossed, the challenge not yet met, the potential not yet realized, the dragon not yet tamed. On a one-way collision course with no turning back, the future, the monster, is always waiting for us and always sees us a-coming. So we should lift our heads, look it in the eye, and watch it heed. Look future in the eye. Use your strength to get through it. Knock out all those fears. You got this. Love you. Hey, brother. Man, you are about to get married, dude. I am excited for you. Uh, I am praying for you and Erica, praying that it's a wonderful day for you guys, praying it's a beautiful ceremony, praying that you guys just, man, look into his eyes, uh, and it's like, it is just this overwhelming peace and excitement uh, for the life that you have together. Um, can't wait to celebrate you and you get back, and this, and this whole thing settles down. Um, but I just, uh, I, I'm thinking about the times that, you know, we spent, me, you, and, and uh, Wells drinking whiskey on the front porch and just uh, just just thankful for those times as, as single men. And here we are now, all married, and um, you soon to be married. Um, and uh, I'll take it the next step. And, uh, man, I'm proud of you. Um, proud to call you my brother in Christ. Proud to, proud to call you a, uh, just a man that, that knows my heart. I know yours. And... Um, thankful for that and um, can't wait to just hear more about the wedding, hear more about um, the first couple of days together, you know, as, as Eric is your wife. And, and have, have a wonderful wedding and have a blast of a wedding night. Okay, see you, brother. Lynch, bud, happy wedding week. I uh, just wanted to send a quick message, letting you know how excited I am uh, for this day. Um, I'm so excited to celebrate you from afar. 
I know that this has been a day that you have been dreaming about and longing for and just uh, hoping and praying for for so long. And so uh, today we get to shout up to heaven and thank God that uh, this day has come and that he has brought Erica into your life. Uh, and we get to celebrate that because that is very good. So um, I just wanted to send you a quick message letting you know how much I appreciate you, uh, how thankful I am for you. You honestly have changed my life. Um, moving into the Remington house, I didn't know what to expect, but uh, it was truly life-changing. Uh, you taught me how to, how to live, how to be intentional, um, what Jesus looks like uh, on a deeper level, and when I think of Ryan Lynch, I think of a great Colorado State Rams fan uh, and someone who is very sarcastic. But more than that, uh, I think of someone who is loyal, um, someone who has a servant heart, um, and someone who's selfless. And so when I think of those three things, uh, I think that that will set you up very well for marriage. Um, and I'm so thankful that Erica has someone like you uh, to love her moving forward. So. Uh, I am so pumped for you guys. Love you tons. Uh, Dana and I wish you the best and enjoy your day. Lynch, I just want to let you know how excited I am for you, you and Erica, man. Um, what an awesome time. I hope that it's just a really, really rich, rich day. Um, sorry that we can't be there in person, but Sarah and I, uh, we love you. We're excited for you, proud of you. Um, I know it's gonna be awesome. We can't wait to celebrate with you when all this silly COVID stuff is over. Uh, just praying blessings over you and really, really thankful for your friendship, man. Um, have a wonderful time. Lynch, bud, you're doing it. You're gonna get it done. All right. Hey, congratulations, man. I'm so excited for you guys. Um, man, it's been a long time coming, I know, but who cares, dude? That's the best. It's the best. You've waited so long. I'm so proud of you for just the guy you are and uh, the way you've waited patiently. Sometimes it probably feels not so patiently, but um, man, it's just been a, it's been a cool testament to the way that you just trusted the Lord and just said, Lord, this is something I want for my life, and I really pray that you will um, bring this to my life, and he has, and he has, and you and Erica are going to have a blast, it's going to be so cool, um, just excited for you guys, congratulations, we love you man, the Fontenot family loves you guys, we can't wait to celebrate uh, whenever A, COVID is done, and B, you have a Fort Collins party, and um, yeah man, excited for you, excited for the future, can't wait to uh, be a part of your married life together, so congrats bro, peace out. Hey buddy, um, I just wanted to let you know you're a legend, not just because of all the things that you did in Steamboat, but also because you're an awesome friend and you're an awesome friend to so many people and I'm just, I'm thankful for you, I love you, um, I, uh, I can't tell you how excited I am for you to, to get married. And, and to, <laughs> To, uh, to, to share your life with somebody else and um, again I'm grateful to be around you um, as you can see if you make children you know they just beat on each other um, it's out of love I'm pretty sure um, but in any case buddy I'm grateful for you um, I'm happy for you and uh, uh, I love you so uh, best wishes and we'll talk to you soon Hey Lynch, my Scandahoovian brother. Just wanted to reach out on your big day, buddy. 
and let you know that I think you're a big jerk. Yeah, you know what that means. It means I hold you in the highest respect uh, and that I love you. Um, every moral, every value I've ever seen you hold is uh, just in the highest respect in my eyes. Uh, you're just such an upbeat, positive person. I love hanging out with you, and I'm so happy that you and Eric found each other. Uh, I know the days will be perfect. Don't even worry about the little things. Keep your eye on the prize, man. It's it's uh, it's going to be perfect. I just know it. So uh, just keep focused on that. Hopefully everything is leading up uh, great for you guys. And I can't wait to celebrate with you on Saturday virtually and then also for your bachelor party after you get married in this crazy post-COVID world. But we're going to enjoy that hot tub again and watch those hotter balloons fly. It's going to be magical. Cannot wait to celebrate with you. Um, so glad that we can be here for you. Thank you for being a brother. And uh, I'm just happy that we get to walk along with each other on our journey. And yeah, I'm just, I'm so happy for you, man. Uh, just know that we're here for you. We love you. And I will see you on the other side, man. Go get it done. Love you. Lynch, dude, you're so loved, man. You're so loved and so blessed. I hope this video blesses you. Um, you know, you, I hope it gives you confidence and knowing that you have so many dudes that love you. You're a great dude. Uh, I'm so thankful for your friendship. You've been uh, a huge part of just my transformation. Um, you know my story and um, I'm so thankful that you were a part of my life in that uh, story and I just am grateful for your joy, for your wisdom, uh, for your encouragement. Uh, more than anything and you're just a guy that uh, is always joyful in every uh, aspect um, in every situation um, knowing your story as well I'm just so impressed with uh, just the way that you interact with life and people I remember just going to church and always seeing you smile and uh, just be the light of Jesus for others and I'm just so thankful that's what you were for me as well uh, I pray blessings over your, you and Erica's wedding. I'm so thankful that you uh, have found that person for you um, and that God has brought you two together. Uh, I'm so encouraged uh, with just hearing about Erica and look forward to getting to know both of you in this new adventure uh, more and uh, just look forward to partying with you, really. Uh, when you get back and uh, celebrating you and Erica. Uh, have a great time in Cancun. Again, I just pray that this video blesses you. It's something that you can always look back on. I uh, hope it gives you confidence and just know that we're praying for you and we're thinking about you. Love you, buddy. Take care. Quarterback keeper, tackle made by number eight, James Campbell, keeps up the middle, tackled by number 53, Isaiah Baldwin. Be monster